Righto, Biodiversity Australia. What a wonderful thing. I always say it's good, but um, well, uh, I think it was Animal Farm, top book. If you haven't read it, get out there, read it, get your kids to read it. Biodiversity in Australia. Some plants are more equal than others. Okay. Pretty retarded stuff. All plants are good. All plants fulfill a function in the environment. Okay. So if you look around, yeah, I've got some clovers, some palm trees, and some other random plants. I don't care. I let everything grow. Weeds, love them. Trees, love them. Yeah. What's bad to say about them? They capture carbon, so at the end of that whole CO2 is bad thing. Throw that shit away. Trees are good. Plant a tree. Stop complaining. Okay. They fix the ground. Why do weeds grow in certain places? Because they're fulfilling a job. Okay. Nature's just trying to fix what we have made a mess of. Right. It's a pretty simple concept. Stop poisoning weeds. For fuck's sake. Please stop poisoning. Okay. Poisons. Bad. Okay, you have to wear all masks and all sorts of gear, it costs you a bunch of money, it's made by big chemical companies. Dumb. Okay. So this here, alright, is just a preamble. Basically, let things grow. They're trying to help us. Now there is a bunch of farmers in Queensland, uh, a place called Longreach. It's way to buggery out in the middle of nowhere. It's a pain in the ass to go there. Been there before. Didn't enjoy it, that's just me, whatever, okay. But um, look, you got a bunch of farmers out there, they're in a war with a particular plant, okay, it's called prickly acacia, right, um, it's quite a hardy plant, it grows really well out there, provides shade, nutrient, feed for animals, it's, it's a win, 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 okay. Stops soil erosion, stops wind erosion, puts nutrients back in the ground, okay? You can't lose, okay? They're stuck out there in droughts and complaining and soaking all the time, but they're trying to wipe this stuff out. They're spending fortunes. There's some people out there that have spent 30, 40 years trying to wipe this stuff out. Stop being dumb. Look at the plant, try to help you, okay? Individuals, do what they want to do, okay? Now the state government in Queensland is also helping to wipe these plants out, okay? That sucks. So A, all of us taxpayers have to put the bill to go and give a whole bunch of money to a few people to achieve an aim that's impossible. You cannot wipe this plant out. It will not happen, okay? So we're all being enslaved, basically. Go out and work, make your money, we're going to take some of it, we're going to give it to those people. Okay, that's socialism, guys. That's a really bad idea. Okay, socialism is evil. Okay, right. I shouldn't have to explain that to people, but apparently I do. So anyways, uh, if you're a farmer and you're trying to wipe out weeds, don't be dumb. Okay, understand what the weed's trying to do, work with it, let it do its job prosper okay make more money you're a capitalist that's a smart idea okay don't be a fucking idiot and go with socialist programs okay that's a bad idea all right now there's all sorts of weeds in australia weeds all right lantana and cat's paw and grasses and vines and all sorts of stuff okay all these plants are doing a job really important job the white fella came to Australia. I might get started on the black fellas. Not yet, that will come. But white fellas came, logged the guts out of a whole bunch of areas. Alright, so basically fucked up the environment pretty bad. Then they ran gazillions of sheep through. They stomped everything to pieces, ate everything that was left, and then they got rid of the sheep and they brought in the cattle. And the cattle, well, you know, nothing against cows and sheep, I like all animals, more or less. But then the cows come through, more stomping, more destruction, alright, and everybody's like, okay, we've got to, we've got to save the environment. Alright, conservationists, you guys, stop doing what you're doing, you're not helping, you're making things worse. Protect the gum trees, because gum trees are native, you've got to protect the native plants. Okay, 
That's wrong. All plants are good. The natives, the gum tree. There are countless billions of gum trees in this country. Okay, under the classification of a weed, they fit it. Gum trees are a weed. Okay, they're poisonous. They're invasive. They cause massive bushfires. Hmm, where have we seen those before? National emergency, anybody? Okay. Cut down the gum tree, grow a plant. Right. Places where lantana is really thick, excellent. Okay, it's repairing the ground, it's putting nutrient back in the ground, it's stopping erosion. Right. It allows birds and other animals to come, feed on the berries, propagate the seeds, allows more plants to grow. And a lot of the time you get a lot of vines that grow around lantana, they grow up with the gum trees, they strangle the gum trees, the gum trees fall over. Awesome. Okay, less gum trees the better. I hate the bastards. Now, um, some people will say, oh, that's bad. That's not natural. <laughs> that's nature in effect. Okay? It's the way it works. Stop being spastics. Use your mind. Don't be stupid. Right? I'm sorry to sound harsh, but sometimes a bit of tough love is needed. So, this is for me to you. Stop being stupid.